Greetings, Geechlings. Geechin Prime here with my live reaction of Mob Psycho 100, Chapter 98. And I'm not even going to try and say, like, how many parts this will be done in, because last time I screwed it up, and I screwed it up a previous time, and it, I have a bad track record. But, uh, I would say between two and three parts. Depending on how into it I get, and, you know, like, I accidentally stop you know, too late to what I would have planned. But anyway, we've got muscular jelly jiggler uh, dimple there. Anybody that doesn't catch that reference, that is a character from Bobo. Bo. He literally looks like him if he was sculpted. <laughs> well, that and not the cheeks. But anyway, yeah. no power, no problem. So that's Mob's idea. Uh, trust? Trust? Why? Also, I'm, I have a cough drop in my mouth. Yeah, throats. Let's see if that helps with the coughing that I typically do. But anyway, because you let me know what you thought of my shirt. That's when I realized that you were Dimple. Oh no, that doesn't really explain anything. Also, I may not be doing the British voice I do with Deadpool in the last one. Weren't you dissatisfied with my way of doing things? You're just going to let me go after all of this? Plus, I was totally trying to rough you up. I'm a dangerous evil spirit. More than rough you up, you blasted him with a laser beam. Uh, you aren't dangerous, Deadpool. I know that already. Uh, and he's like, uh, uh, which is probably what the fan base was thinking at this point. Uh, you just got a little carried away. Why is that becoming a theme lately? It happens to everyone, probably. It happened to you, Mob. It can happen to anyone. Uh, that's what Master Reagan was saying. You're wrong. The timing was right to take action and proceed with the plan of my own devising. I gained self-confidence, reinforced uh, by my calculated efforts. Don't lump me in with all the folks who are just caught up in the moment. I also don't know what this voice is at the time, <laughs> so bear with me. I too got carried away, so I understand. <laughs> eh? No. You weren't really. I mean, it's not like you're usually way too mild-mannered or... No, I was awfully caught up in the moment. I'm sorry. What do you mean by sorry? You're not trying to win me over with some vague, uh, appraisement, are you? I was too carried away that I didn't listen to you, Dimple. Okay, and he's remember when Dimple proposed the whole, You become the cult leader and I'll guide you. Uh, when you asked me to take part in your plan, why didn't you stop doing bad things? Oh, flashback. Ah, uh, I should have listened to you properly that time. I was so focused on whether I was becoming popular that I overlooked more important things. I'm sorry, Dimple. It looks more like they're in a forest than on a giant tree, you know? Well, minus the the vi the viney veiny ground that's going on there uh something you always wanted to do when the thing you had endlessly longed for was finally within your reach you asked me to be a part of it you could have done this and realized your dream by yourself but you invited me to join that was the most important thing you weren't doing bad things you were just doing what you wanted to do and that that can go both ways. <laughs> I mean, it's like, if you wanted to destroy all of mankind, well, you wanted to do it, but hey, you, you're still doing bad things. I could do other examples, but given recent events in the world, I don't want to get too specific, and people hate me, even though it wouldn't be totally wrong. Yeah. Together with me, you trusted me before I trusted you, Dimple. Thank you. I I don't know if Dimple really trusted him 
unless that was a very recent development because I mean the kind of was scared of him was just kind of a hang along hey quit that don't you just decide for yourself how I was feeling that's so creepy I'm getting goosebumps okay something felt off I had a vague feeling that something was wrong with this huge amount of power falling into my hands gathering followers in huge numbers lacking any natural enemies in particular I can put myself at the center of the world but even though I've practically become a god and fulfilled my plan it isn't much fun well yeah once you're on the top the struggle is what makes things interesting because if everything is laid before you it, it's like well I, I accomplished everything I wanted to and the world is my oyster literally so what, what do I do now <laughs> that, that's why I just thought it was weird that he continues to want to become a god because this realization was going to happen I was never able to empathize, uh, empathize with this guy I wondered why he never used psychic power in his everyday life he never lent an ear to my misleading words it was a lukewarm feeling though I did get pissed off sometimes only Subami chan the girl he likes when I saw him wishing that she would turn and look at him I n noticed a similar feeling lurking within me I want to be acknowledged my own existence now oh, and he's looking at a rat he's at the beach he's looking at people on the street and now he's talking to mob in this flashback when I met Shigeo he paid attention to me at a ghost without being scared or getting scared without feeling uncomfortable eventually he accepted me I want that evil face when that happened I thought I can use him uh, yeah and uh, freaky Fred and it's like and then I got naughty <laughs> or however the line <laughs> uh, uh, and on top of that I felt a certain tension in my heart beginning to relax it felt like my ambitions would fade away did spending time with unselfish Shigeo cause me or cause even me to lose sight of my goals eh, wait that's a problem I'll lose my reason for existing wait is that part of the reason why he wants to become a god because if he oh, yeah. if it if he gets rid of the concept in his mind will he have no unfinished business and then will he just pass on hmm. if the Casper movie has taught me anything I think that's the key <laughs> it's anchoring him here so Dimple may not die in a traditional fashion <laughs> to what we've become accustomed to in this series no not yet I'm not done yet even now I've still got plenty of things I want to do and ambitions you kind of sound like Vegeta there yeah yeah tell me what you want to do I'll hear you out for real as your friend boy he really looking tired there mom I guess this is fine golds and believers aside though I didn't realize until now friends are what I wanted Shigeo you're an amazing guy okay and we're in the Omake uh, stake story in the past I would often go to the local oh god with that barbecue thing again the Yaki Niku shop after finishing a manuscript good job today or work today then I moved home then I moved house there were no restaurants nearby nearby but I still wanted to eat meat so after finishing the storyboard and manuscript I decided to buy some raw steak at the supermarket I got a slab of domestic beef for around 1800 yen ooh domestic beef well that's probably I don't really I guess that would be the cheaper instead of importing yeah I know Japan imports a lot of things like fruit is ridiculous there although it was cheaper than the 4,000 yen I'd 
usually spent on uh, yakiniki. Not, yeah, I can't say that word consistently. I ate it with some watercrest and had a great time. No punchline, Finn. Okay, we're in part... Technically, it that wasn't even a section, so I... I don't know if it's one who numbered them this way, or is it just this website? I don't know. Okay, Dimple's looking up at the rays coming through the tree. Ah, I give up. What? The townspeople. I'll stop messing with their minds, and I'll erase their memories of the fake psycho helmet I created. You can do that? I think that's the, it's the first time we've seen, like, uh, memory wiping. Then everyone will be themselves again. When the source of worship energy disappears, the divine power will be lost. I will go back to how I was. Yeah, back to his little spirit form. Even though I was your dream to become a god. Or, oh, I read that. And that was Mob saying that. Huh? Are you really okay with that? I'm giving it up because of your weak-ass argument managed to convince me. Uh, oh, I see. <laughs> uh, let's go home. Yeah. Oh, oh, mob just collapsed. Hey, what's wrong, Shigeo? I must have put out too much power. My body won't move properly. He's like Chopper after Monster Point. So it's not your own fault. So it's your own fault. Man, why'd you have to be so careless? I guess it can't be helped. Okay, now he's giving him a piggyback ride. After you joined the body, our body improvement club, you got carried uh, like this every day for a while, huh? Dimple, how long are you going to keep that form? Well, I transformed into this when I got powered up. So it'll last until the divine uh, power naturally fades. Maybe another week or so? Wait, I can't... Oh, that was Dimple. Ugh, I hate talk bubbles where you can't tell who's actually saying them. You mean you'll be hanging around my house for a week in that state? Could I ask you to maybe wait a week before you come over? No, oh, that's kind of pissing me off. You can be pretty harsh sometimes, even when I'm in the middle of my grieving. Of grieving my broken dreams. Ah, oh, that reminds me. The broccoli. I was supposed to do something about this broccoli. Master Reagan said that if we leave it alone, the roots will keep growing until the town is destroyed. And then we already know, if you've been watching my other videos, of what that probably would lead to eventually. I see. What did you guys plan to do with this enormous plant, anyway? Pick it up with telekinesis and sink it in the ocean. Huh? Something like that is just... Well, I can't say it's impossible, but... You know, what's scary about... Uh, that's what's scary about you, Shigeo. You rivaled even my current power level, after all. Anyway, it's too much for today. Let's stop making preparations tomorrow, and then go from there. No, you need to deal with this now, because I feel like there's going to be a problem. <laughs> because there's still too much of the series left. <laughs> such a fine broccoli, and it created such a stir among everyone in town. It seems like I, it was becoming a real tourist attraction. I feel kind of bad for it. But we have no choice. People are fascinated by things that are overwhelming or mystical like that. This broccoli is a supernatural existence. But you know, in truth, your own existence is beyond that, Shigeo. Your psychic power is what created this. I only managed to attract followers by using the feelings of everyone who had already gathered around the Divine Tree. Even Hanazawa, who supposedly, or who was supposedly converted, right before you sent him flying, <laughs> his respect for you far exceeded his respect for Psycho Helmet. What I mean is, you could be a unifying force, even greater than the Divine Tree. You might even have enough appeal to win the hearts of people all over the world. If you were to use our psychic power wisely. Hey, you listening? Oh no, he's not. He doesn't look too good. 
that's too many details to wrap my head around. I'm feeling super sleepy all of a sudden. Can you wake me up when I when we get to my house? Hey, I'm not your damn servant. Just who do you think I? Annie's asleep. Tch, better not drool on me. Well, you could have worn clothes, Nibble. I said, let's go home, but I don't really have any place to go home to, and I don't have anything to aim for from here. I wonder what I should do now. What? This is what I said, get rid of the damn tree now, because now the Psycho Helmet puppet is alive. Hey, wh what? The tree now has sentience. <laughs> Psycho Helmet? But I'm not controlling the Divine Tree anymore. What are you doing here? H who are you? Wait, I have a bad hunch about this. After absorbing thoughts from the Believers and myself, and the Divine Tree gained sentience, could it be that a Psycho Helmet self has, or was already developing within the Divine Tree, waiting for me to relinquish control? Watching vision or vigilantly, I can't say that with this accent apparently, ready to steal the right to command that enormous energy as soon as I lost control. That uh, nourishment, put it down. Oh no, <laughs> should you? Know, we gotta wake, or you gotta wake up. Shit is hitting the fan. <laughs> Okay, and Mob is doing some weird-ass dance in this thing. Okay. Mm. Ow. <laughs> that kind of hurt my face. Uh, let's see. Mm. Itchy nose. The Psycho Helmet is aiming at you. Uh, let's see. Damn, are you serious? Why is it running at him in such a weird way? Okay, he jumped out of the way, and he's going into the branches. Wake up, Shigeo. This isn't the time to rest. It's useless. Wake up already. My nose is itchy as all balls right now. Uh, let's see here. Uh, why does it have such a weird mouth? Oh, he blasted it. God beam. God. Okay. Oh. I thought that was Dimple's hand for a second, which I should have known was not. But I did. Okay, he's got him. Dimple, you gotta save him. Oh, he's created more bodies. Lovely. He's learned all the tactics you were using. You assholes! <laughs> oh. I'll make you bastards return, Shijiu. Okay, I think he's using God Dash now. Okay, and he's powering up his laser. Oh no, they, they, yep, they've copied all of his moves because they're doing the same thing. And now they're all, and there's so many of them that are firing at the same time. Okay, he has God Barrier up. And now it's more of an aura, and he's trying to fight them off. They're absorbing it. Oh wait, I missed some. The panels are so small. My power. They're absorbing it. Okay, now he's just brawling with them. Uh, that's probably the best way to conserve his energy. Okay, fire to beam. They're still coming. He can manipulate his form. Okay. Eh, makes sense. Is Mob starting to wake up? Oh, you're finally awake. Can you move? No, I can't move at all. I can't see well either. Oh god, look at that eye. I see. I think I heard a loud or a loud noise, but what happened? Nothing happened. You sure you weren't dreaming? You are pretty much half asleep. Uh, we still haven't arrived home yet? Yeah, I just sat down to take a break. Dimple doesn't have a body in this thing, does he? Because he looks much shorter than he should be. I'm kind of tired, you know. I see. Shigeo. Right now, I have my uh, initial strength. 
but this is the first time I've used this much power. And all this time you've been living with the same level of psychic power. It's come to the point where I can imagine how great it, it can be right now. You wanted to be popular with the girls and got carried away, which was kind of cute. You are that kind of guy. You could have taken your powers for granted and gotten carried away with that, uh, which is natural. And you could have abused them, as, and yet, you thought that through, Shigeo. You are a man, and you can become big. Hmm. Huh. Thing dissolved and starting to stab me in the cheek. <laughs> Let's see. Only now will I use my hypnosis on you. Listen carefully. This will be the first and last command to you from me. Firstly, get up and then stand, Shigeo. Well, getting up and standing are the same thing. And he's doing it. It's useless. I can hardly use my legs. My arms can't move either. Even if your body says you can't, you must stand. Even if you cannot stand, you must try to stand. And then walk on your own feet. Go. What about you? Ikubo? What? Is that what Dimple's name is in Japanese, or am I confused? I have to drop by some place for a bit. Oh. That's a bigger body. That's a bigger body. Its eyes are eclipsing the light. And I was right, Dimple is missing a good bit of his body. So go back first. Yes, I will. That actually might be a good thumbnail. <laughs> okay, he's gotten up. He's starting to walk away. And Dimple's about to be destroyed. You shouldn't have turned around, Mob. Oh, look, he's like, bye. <laughs> and Mob's only seeing him in his little spirit form. Take care. I don't know what that sound effect is. I assume that's him being destroyed. I think the days of Dimple are gone, you guys. <laughs> and Mob's just walking down the road, and I hear a bunch of more sound effects, and I don't know what they are. I really wish I could read Japanese. Oh, he's missing a leg now, and one arm he had is mostly gone. Nope, oh, the vines are tick. Oh, he's going to eat him. Oh, Mob. If a Wait, what is that? What is happening? Is it breaking apart? All the followers. Let's let's go home. Everyone, let's go home. And the trees just kind of like looming in the background. I don't know what happened. Shigeo, you caught another cold? You should eat more than uh, than that if you want to get better. Okay, but I want to go lay down for a bit. Okay, he's at home. Oh, I see what's happening on the TV. The tree is floating in the air now. Nissan, look at the news. It's incredible. You're not the one doing this, right? This is footage from just a moment ago. The ongoing natural disaster in Spice City. We have confirmed that the enormous plant, which came to be known as the Divine Tree after it suddenly appeared, is currently floating through the air. It is vanishing into the distance. What on earth is going on? I don't know what or who's responsible, but this is amazing. What are they even trying to accomplish with something like this? How mysterious. Ah, uh, speaking of my mist or of mysteries, my memories from this evening are all fuzzy. And when I mentioned it to mom, she said it was the same for her. That her memories from a little while ago are all blurry and hard to remember clearly. Okay, so the mind or the mind control and the mind or memory erasal was successful, but it doesn't feel strange or unpleasant. 
Did the same thing happen to you by chance? Me too. I can't remember anything from earlier tonight. I'm not even sure how I got home. So, even Nissan is affected. Maybe something happened a few hours ago. I wonder if perhaps it was some kind of mass hypnosis. I bet Dimple knows all about fishy things like this. Oh, don't even mention Dimple. He's gone. I can't find him right now, but next time he shows up, let's ask him about it. All right. And Nissan, you said you were, weren't were feeling good, so get well soon. Okay. And Mob's in his room by himself now. I cannot remember. I cannot remember, but Dimple, thank you. Dimple is a friend. And always crying. Wait, are the... Does he know? Omake greeting, and we have Toshino. Happy New Year. Hoshino. Damn it, I always get it wrong. <laughs> Hoshino Takashi. I think I thought the T from his first name. <laughs> Why are you... At... Why do you ask? Hmm, because this year we will make or make a star of, or make me a star of course i'll be playing an active role so stay tuned the series is almost over dude i don't think you need to worry about that wasn't he a friend of yours risu yeah sure uh what, what was his name again <laughs> oh god i didn't even have any material dude so soon after new year's so i thought i'd sneak this guy in and try letting him bear the burden for a change so you finally got yourself involved in this kind of risky experiment. So it was Reagan's doing then, huh? Okay. We're in, this will be the final segment I read, I believe. Because there are, how many segments? There are nine. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll read it. I think it's short. Yeah, it's only ten pages. Okay. Final segment for this video, unless I get carried away. Like Bob! <laughs> uh, let's see here. Winter break starts next week. The end of the year is inching closer. Okay, we got all the students in the school. As are the private and general entrance exams that will finally begin in the new year. Because you are all perfectly prepared to take the exam. I don't think you'll, or there will be a problem, but... Make sure to keep your wits about you and study all night, every night. All night, every night. Yes, that that's what a growing mind needs. No rest. I would say study at least an hour or two a night, you know, and then get a good night's sleep. But no, don't, no. All night, every night. Uh, stand, bow. Yeah, graduation. Is that soon? I, I'm out of time. Okay, so we got Tommy, and she wants those aliens. <laughs> you said you wanted to talk about something important. Please hear me out. In a little over three months, uh, Kiji Bayashi and I will be graduating. Oh, I did. I must have forgotten that she was actually a third year. And that happens, when that happens, only, you know, uh, Kawa and uh, Suruta, or blah, I can't read these names for something. Right. Saruta will remain. Unable to continue our activities, the club will most likely come to a natural end. Isn't that sad? Yeah, when you're losing half the club, <clears throat> I mean, Mob will be there, but is he even really part of that club anymore? I mean, are they even in a club to begin with? I mean, they just use the room that the Body Improvement Club uses. Hmm. Even less of a reaction than I expected. Yeah, they're not worried anyway, are they? What's so sad about that, eh? At this rate, it'll be over without us having created any memories, you know? Look back at what we've uh, done up to this point. Yeah, they've done, like, nothing except snacks and video games and comics. We do have memories. Eating cake, idly chatting, playing card games, video games, competitions. No, no, that's not what I mean. Oh, now she's crying. 
and they're freaking out. It's like, uh, leader, what's going on? <laughs> Why are you crying? D does your tummy hurt or something, President? Did you think of studying for exams and falling into sp despair? Not that I'm in any better shape. <laughs> Our research on telepathy still hasn't yielded any results, and we haven't even met any aliens. There's hardly any time left. It's now or never. And she's just pounding her fist on the table and saying, ah, it all sucks. <laughs> well, when you graduate, you can keep working on it in high school, right? I mean, we can't really do anything with the time we have left. Since we don't have a laboratory or espers or anything, if they only knew. Actually, they should know. <laughs> Is that something to cry about? Eh, yeah, to be honest, it's still hard for me to take, uh, to take seriously, but, President, you really meant that about contacting aliens. The funny thing is, I was watching E.T. just the other day. <laughs> it's like, E.T. for long. There's a lot about that movie I must have forgotten. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm wondering if this is going to play into things. Uh, I mean, what I say, and I've also thought of pursuing this on my own as a hobby, but this is the only time we have with all of us together. You were the only ones who accepted my weird ambition and joined me as a club, or as club members. To me, this place was special. Someday we'll forget about each other, getting together in the club room after school and chatting idly. In time, all of that will be forgotten. The activities we did as a group. Don't you want to leave behind something unforget or leave behind some unforgettable experience? In this middle school with these club members, we're almost out of time for club activities. Don't you get it, you guys? She suddenly gained the enthusiasm of a sports club before a big tournament. But president, that's so. Huh? Mm, excuse me. Go on, take a sip. How she really thought of us. If I went home right now, I'd be free until dinner time, so I only thought of this as a place to kill some time after school, and yet I could go to a non telepathy club, uh, friend's house, and, and do the same kind of thing, so I didn't think this was special at all. I finally started thinking about what kind of club activities I want to get into next year, and yet. So they're starting to realize this club meant more to them than they might have realized. Or vice versa, I don't know. My brain's not working in this moment. <laughs> hey, what do you guys think? Or what do you think, everybody? What do you mean, Inakoa? Eh? <laughs> well, let's hear from the youngest first. What do you say, Shurita? Uh, tell us what you think of the president's feelings. Telepathy is, uh, sorry, what, what was our goal again? <laughs> God, she's exhaling a, a smoke. <laughs> now, wow, she, she has amazing lung capacity. She might be angry. It's fine. I'd better start studying for the exam entrance exams. So she hasn't even started yet? Not that I've started either. Boy, you are just both horrible, aren't you? <laughs> uh, practically all the other 30 years are retiring from their clubs. I should do the same. The telepathy club is hereby disbanded. Thanks for everything, you three. It was pretty fun. Okay, oh, make selfie. We have the pyro guy. I have to say, he's gotten a lot better. He can now just ignite his hand with visibly no effort. Ah, oh, this one turned out good. Oh, he's doing self. Okay, so he's taking selfies of himself using his powers. I'll update my profile picture. A few days later, he was paid a visit. Okay, good lord, he almost has 27,000 posts. Well, okay, and that ends it for this video. Um, we'll be starting part five on through part nine of it, or section, whatever I decide to call it. You know, it's different every, <laughs> every instant. But uh, 
interesting. I'm sad to see Dimple dead unless he ends up popping up again, which at the, given how late into the series this is, I don't see it happening. But yeah. Also, who was moving the tree? I will be interested to find that out. Unless it was the tree itself, because it did seem to have a sentience, but then when that whole thing of it like turning into rock, it looked like it was being petrified and broken. I don't know if it still has that sentience. So, hmm. Outside forces. Truly, it's not aliens, right? Because, I mean, with this whole thing with this club, I'm almost suspecting aliens. And then watching E.T. Will the stars align? Literally? Who will know? But anyway, I'll know soon enough. But anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me at Twitter at Keishan Prime. And I'll see you next time. Keishlings, roll out.